Hey, how's it going, everybody? This is Gareth the Cage, and welcome back to We Happy Few on the Xbox One X. We are currently on the bridge. We went through basically a re, re, uh, try to think of relearning of everything on how to be a proper person out in public, and hopefully this ends well for us. May I express my delight that you passed the examination, sir? We've not had as many as we'd hoped, sir. Not as many at all. And yet, they say the unexamined life is not worth living. Well, sir, welcome back. Oh, and in case your rustication has been of long duration, please bear in mind there is now a nocturnal curfew. Best be indoors after nightfall, sir. If I want him to bugger off, I bet a nice bottle of scotch would help. <laughs> On to the village. Ooh, isn't this wonderful? Oh, I can't remember Welcome the last time someone came through. <laughs> so from here. I've got to get to St. George's home, and then into the parade. Except that I need a letter of transit to get into the parade. Like the one I left on my desk in the parade. How do I get a new one? Hmm. Wait. The old government printing office was on Maiden Home. Maybe I can break in and steal some blanks. Oh, that's, uh, that's the first thing that would come to my mind, I know. I got five more skill points here. Um, let's do the healing. That seemed like a pretty nice one to, to get. There you are. You're looking nice and trim. Couldn't be better, thanks. Did you hear they've caught Foggy Jack? Isn't that a relief? Yeah, especially when you don't move your mouth. Should clear up soon, I imagine. I got a new compliment machine. It's so clever. You look smashing. Lovely day for it. Lovely day for it. I saw a spanker spanker downer just now. It was so jolly. A joy detector. Well, I'd better take my joy. I don't have any more joy. Is that a problem? Should I? Can I buy some somewhere? I know that they told me about it in the last episode, but. Lovely weather. Arthur Hastings, I thought you turned into. Uh, oh, never mind. Here you are. Yep, here I am. <gasps> Trying to see what the reason to get up on there would be. Really know on that one. Lord, why are there peepers patrolling the park? I should snoop around a bit. Area is under supervision. Okay. Cheers up a bobby like a nice bottle of scotch. Allow me 
Everyone's mad. Poor thing. What's she on about? That's the one. Right, right. Oh, I've had it with you. Oh, this is a bad turn. God, I'm famished. Murderer? I didn't do anything. So he did it. Oh! I didn't do anything. Don't be so bloody difficult. Stop them. Well, I'm glad all the I don't have any. <laughs> Look at them. They got the one that did it. I've had it with you. Mercy on the elderly. I don't have any. I promise. I wish I had some joy right now and pop it right in front of you. There's the one that did it. He did it. I know he did. You won't get away with this. I might as well like it if I get too close to that. Unless I look like a council worker, I suppose. <laughs> I wish I kept in shape. Yeah. I see ya. I know they're coming with me. That's them. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Why isn't there a park bench I could take a sit down on for just 30 seconds? Right. Oh, it doesn't kill you. Did I hide? Is this the back of the, did I make it all the way around? <laughs> did I literally just walk all the way around? Eat the sandwich. Let's eat a sandwich. Not the moldy bread. Day for it. Dangerous traps in there? WTF? Lovely day for it. Did you hear? The circus is coming to town. You know, I think someone's looking for you. Lovely day for it. Did you hear? Mrs. Sapper found a bomb buried Should in clear her up soon, I imagine. What? Lucky it didn't blow her up. Okay, we're all good. We're all good. You can take your joy immediately. She's jumping in puddles. Why don't you beat the hell out of her? You can take your joy immediately. Huh? Bunch of crap. Lovely weather. I can't wait to see how they fixed up Lutz Holm. I wouldn't get too close to that. You're liable to get 
quite a shock. What's gone wrong here, Constable? What's gone wrong, sir, is a complete lack of preventative maintenance. Council workers don't test the poppers anymore. They don't even see them until something electronic goes tits up. Just lucky one of the lads wasn't in there when it decided to become a spanker. So you're waiting for a council worker? I'm not holding my breath. But I hope one comes soon because I've got places to be. I wonder how I can get a boiler suit. Wear a bowler suit. Boiler suit. Where am I gonna get one of those at? I wish these these buildings and doors would be. Move along, please. What's done what happened done? to him? Nothing to oh, see I'm not here. quite sure. He's been a solid now citizen as long as I've been on this business. beat. Yesterday and today he's gone on about to leaving me. Amlin, waving around a suitcase like a rotten downer. Well, we can't have that. Don't know where he thought he was going. Nobody goes to the Garden District, don't have to. Maybe he had relatives across the bridge. <laughs> That's right. There's been an outbreak of relatives across the bridge. Has there been an outbreak of downers? Um, no. Of course not. There's nothing to worry about. Well, that's a relief. I'm sure the joy is just as good as it's ever been. Each batch just gets better and better. <laughs> you keep taking it. It'll take care of you. Okay. So this is where I can get joy at. Okay, so the, the phone booths, basically. Ah, oh, that's a shame, that is. I told you to leave the moon juice alone, Eddie. What were you thinking? Going near a spanker like that. You never had the common sense that God gave an ordinary bowl of porridge, did you? What am I supposed to tell Sarah then? Can't exactly tell he had died heroically in the line of duty, can I? Wish you'd join the force with me. What a shame. What a shame. Thank what? God for the spankers, right? We can't have downers breaking the pumps any time they want a bucket of moon juice. What would Eddie need Motorline for, anyway? Maybe he had an hobby. What? He was using it to power a set of model trains? Nah. That's not like Eddie. Oh, no. Oh. He had a sort of... aversion to details. Maybe he was setting rat traps in the sewers. You'd need a torch for that. Yeah. Traps require long-term planning. To which he also had a sort of aversion. Well, he wasn't bloody drinking it, was he? What are you getting at? I wonder if Lionel Kashir is dealing in contraband motorly. You might be right. Maybe we should pay him a call. I'm just glad the spanker didn't spark up the motorline. Can you imagine? With half the fire department off on holiday. Uh, do -do. Lovely day for it. Watch out for scurvy. Uncle Jack says. Nothing but blue skies. Watch out for scurvy. Uncle <laughs> Jack says. Did you just say watch out for scurvy? Yeah, that's something most people should be worrying about. Such a weird atmosphere. Like, you get these bright colored roads. And these lights, and then you get these tattered buildings and such. It's just really strange. I love it. Very well, are they? I wonder if I can help him. 
funny. You smell... important. Yes, I'm a chemist, and I've invented a new cologne. I call it Mojo. Uh -huh. It makes you smell like a doctor. You see, Beatrice has always had a soft spot for doctors. And you know how they have that distinctive smell. Mojo makes you smell like that. And it works? Not on Beatrice. Doctors are much nicer to me. But she is not. Have you tried giving her flowers? She only likes night-blooming non-suches. And where would I get those? In the garden district. Right. Well, good luck then. I have a whole bunch of those. Where's, where's my closest thingy at? This is cool. Couldn't be better, thanks. Oh, hello. Aren't you tall? Yes. I, uh, oh, I suppose I am a little. There's room for two on this bench, you know. Oh, yes. Well, I suppose I could. To not be so tall and all. I love to come here and read. Do you like books? Yes. Who doesn't? I'm, uh, I've been collecting a lot of books recently. Uh, in the go in the garden district, if you can imagine. Oh, that's so brave of you. Ah, oh, they're not really cannibals, you know. You just have to talk to them. But don't they bring you down? Oh, <laughs> well, I suppose they would if I listened. <laughs> you must tell me all about your adventures. <laughs> I have to. I mean, oh, goodness. I have to go see a chap. Do you have to? Oh, I... I sort of have to get back to the parade. Don't know when I'll be back. Hard to make predictions, especially about the future. Huh. Oh, come back any time. See a memory over here. Percy, you're soaked. I'm fine. You're not. Your lips are blue and you're shivering. Where's your coat? In the closet. Why didn't he put it on? I don't know. It's been raining all day. Did he not notice the drops of water falling out of the sky? It what? It, it wasn't raining. It was drizzling. Now you're going to get sick, and then I'm going to get sick, and then Dad is going to get sick. I gotta check. So I've noticed subtitles aren't going on anymore. I meant to check that last. See, they turned them off. I had subtitles on for a while. I've totally forgot because I was going to check that between episodes. Oh, where's the map? Okay, let's take a look. There's a shop right in front. You will take your joy immediately. You will take your joy immediately. Okay. That's right. Lovely day for it. Did you hear? Foggy Jack. Excuse me, excuse me. Oh, <gasps> we're life for noise. Papa Joy. It all changed. I expected it to, but holy crap. All right. All right. I totally expected it to change. Don't get me wrong. But this is this is a whole different kind of just disturbing. What your fancy? Lionel Cashier. Nice to see the old shop still running. As long as the old ticker's going. Come to buy or come to sell. Arthur, you're an ingenious sort of fellow. I'm a buyer, 
a collector who likes to collect golden records. Now, I happen to know where there's three of them out in the garden district. If you'd go get them for me, I'd make it worth your while. Why don't you get them? Go to the garden district? Oh, oh, of course, of course, there's, there's nothing I'd like better. <laughs> go out there, see the old streets, but I'm uh, so busy with the shop and all, oh, I can hardly step out for Simon Says. <laughs> and you know how people are when you miss a village activity. No, no, uh, here's a map for you. Best if you do it. Okay. So you have to survive harder. Look at that. Work veg upgrade kit, a repair kit. Hmm. Proper shoes, light bulbs. Riding boots. Oh, that's a quest item. I'm gonna go oh, and buy like that. that. It's one of my favorites. I'm sure it is. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, this has been. Look at this. This is actually really pretty. I love this. Like I thought it was crazy looking before. I was like, man, it's kind of dark still, and you pop a joy, man. Look at this. Who would who would say no to seeing this all the time? So. Should and this is just after I one. Hello there, love. Imagine if you popped more. So, well, maybe one time we'll find out. Thank you all for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you can, give the video a like. It does help us out quite a bit. Also, check out the channel because we have tons of videos going on over there. And until next time, you guys, stay frosty.